Shoulder abduction arthrokinematics consists of a superior roll and inferior glide of the humeral head on the glenoid fossa. Tissues involved include the joint capsule, bursa, and muscles that control motion of the shoulder complex. Joint mobilization forces can be used to help relieve pain or increase mobility. The goal is to cause a change in the tissues surrounding the shoulder complex. To reduce pain, the joint is mobilized using gentle movements carried out in either the very beginning or the mid-range of the available range of the joint. A grade 1 or 2 mobilization is primarily used. This oscillatory motion can help to alleviate pain via pain mechanoreceptor inhibition, a reflex inhibition of the muscle contraction or spasm, or through the promotion of muscle relaxation. To increase range of motion into abduction, the joint is placed in the available range or end range of the joint and into resistance, and then the mobilization is carried out. This motion into the restriction stretches the tissues and helps to break up adhesions. Grades 3 and 4 are primarily used to increase range of motion. To perform an inferior joint glide, position the patient in supine on a plinth with the side beam mobilized close to the edge of the mat. Raise plinth to a comfortable height for proper body mechanics. Place patient's shoulder in the loose pec position of slight flexion, 55 degrees abduction and slight external rotation for grades one and two. Palpate the glenohumeral joint line and move slightly distal onto the humeral head. The therapist's hand placement is as close to the joint line as possible. Apply a piccolo distraction to unweight the articular surfaces. Mobilization is applied using body weight to glide the joint in the inferior direction parallel to the joint line. Grade one mobilization is gentle, small amplitude oscillations in the very beginning of available end range. Grade two mobilizations, gentle oscillations of larger amplitude in the mid range of the joint. For grades three and four, you're going to progress towards end range and the position of desired motion. The grade three mobilization is moderately sized oscillations of larger amplitude through the available joint range and into the resistance. Grade four mobilizations, small oscillations at end range and into the resistance. Attempt 30 seconds of treatment if tolerated and immediately reassess pain level or movement to see if either have changed for better or worse. If improvement is noted, may continue for 60 to 90 seconds and repeat until there is no further change in pain or range of motion. So after my assessment of your right shoulder, I see that you are having some mobility issues moving your arm up like this. So um, what I'm gonna be doing is a treatment that's called an inferior joint mobilization. Mm -hmm. And what this does is it helps to increase your range of motion, also bringing in some um, nutrients and extra blood flow to help promote healing. Um, so because you're not having really any pain anymore, um, I'm going to go ahead and take you more into your end range and work more just on the mobility. Um, so I'm going to have you lie down on your back for me, please. And I'm going to raise up the table. And I'm going to have you scooch as close as you can to me. 
Oops, I'm going to go ahead and wash my hands really quick. All right, are you comfortable? Mm -hmm. Good. Okay, so it's really important for you to relax during this. At um, no point in time should you have any pain while I'm doing this. So if you do experience some discomfort, just let me know, okay? okay. So I'm going to have to take your arm. Right. I'm kind of going to have to put my arm up in your armpit, okay? That's fine. Any pain with this? No. Good. We're going to go ahead and try to do it for about 30 seconds. Okay. Alright, how do you feel? Feels good. Good. I can have you sit back up. Can you raise that arm up to the side as high as you can go? How's that feel? Feels better. Good. It looks like you're getting more range. So I think we're going to go ahead and continue doing this treatment um, as much as you can tolerate um, for our next session. Okay. Any questions for me? No, I'm good. All right. Sounds good.